Hi guys, so my friend has this old Dell laptop here and I just upgraded it to Windows 10 and it works fine, just slow. For example, it takes more than two minutes to boot up, that's crazy. Also, application take quite some time to launch and browsing around the machine can take a bit of time too. Basically, it's not my style of computing. Now, there's a simple way to actually improve this machine here's performance a huge deal. Replace its hard drive with a solid state drive or SSD. Now the machine here has a 500 gigabyte hard drive, but I would need an SSD of the same capacity. Just one that has more space than the amount of space currently occupied by data on the hard drive. In this case, it's about 40 gigabyte. So this 240 gigabyte SSD is going to be more than enough. This one is also a budget drive, so it's not too expensive either, costing some $60, but still is more than fast enough. Of course, if you need more space, you can also get a larger SSD or even faster one too, if you can afford it. Now for the job here, you can also need a USB to SATA adapter. This one here costs you about $15 and it's a $15 well spent because this kind of adapter will come in very handy. You can also need a small screwdriver here to open up the laptop later. And finally, you will need a cloning software. Now my favorite is the free version of Macrium Reflect that you can get from download.com. Now the entire process can be described in one sentence. You clone the existing hard drive's content onto the SSD, then physically replace the hard drive with the SSD. And that's it. After that, your machine will be exactly the same, except it's much faster. Now on to the detailed steps. First, you download and install Macrium Reflect. Then now, connect the SSD to computer USB port. Then you run the Reflect software and choose to clone the existing hard drive onto the USB connected drive. Next, just follow the rest of the wizard and then sit back and relax, or not, and wait for the process to be finished. And then finally, turn off the computer and then swap out the two drives. Here we go. Look how good I am with a tiny screwdriver. And that's it. Now you can put the old hard drive away as a backup or you can use it with the adapter here as an external hard drive. But the most important thing is, you will notice that your computer now is going to be a lot faster. For example, this particular one here now takes less than 30 seconds to boot. You can also expect the laptop's battery life to be a bit longer too. And by the way, you can also do the same thing with your desktop. And then after that, you can help your friends out by forwarding them this video. They will love it. You'll make that day. And that's because I'm done with.